Hi everybody, it's Jiggy Time Gal, and it's here finally. The long overdue, most anticipated, most requested video on my channel. How to use the E-Juice Me Up calculator. It is available on the internet for free download and you can use it offline on your desktop anytime you choose to mix up DIY juices of your choice in any flavor, any milligram nicotine, any VG, PG combinations of your choice when you want. So here we go. Let's get into it. Okay, here we go. This is the Juice Me Up calculator. Description will be, or the link will be in the description below. Here we go. This is nicotine strength e juice here at the top. This is where you put in if uh, your uh, nicotine is PG or VG. Um, you would put it if it's 100% PG, 100% VG, or 50-50, or we'll go 50-50 for Over here is where you put in how many milligrams it is. 24 milligrams, 50 milligrams, 65 milligrams, whatever. We're going to go with 100 because that is what I usually use. Let me go back over here. This is your target nicotine strength. This is what you want your strength of your e-juice to be in the end result. So, they got 12 here. I'm going to put down 6 because that is what mine usually is. If you want um, 12, if you want 24, if you want 30, you're going to put that in there. Then down here as the next option, it says amount to make. So if you want to make a small batch of 10 milligrams, milliliters, I'm sorry, milliliters, or if you want to make a large batch of 120 milliliters, you plug that in here. Now, we're going to put a small amount in here of, we're going to put um, 10 milliliters, because a lot of people in my other video have requested the drops. They want to make smaller amounts, so they want to know how many drops it's going to take to make it. So that's what we're going to do. Now the next one down here, it says water, vodka, or P, um, PGA. Um, some people add this to their mix, it's not required. Um, but if you want to add that to your mix, then you're gonna put it right here in a percent amount. Um, I don't add any of that. Then down here is where things are going to get a little confusing. They have 10 slots for you to put flavors. Now, if you're mixing a flavor like Turtles Candy and you want to add chocolate, caramel, and um, pecan, you will put in those flavors separately in each column and you will add how much percent over to the right that you want to add of each flavor. Now, I normally do not do that. I just do straight one flavors and I usually do French Vanilla. And I usually um, write down here, there's a little box that says zero PG um, VG. Some places have zero PG um, VG for their concentrate flavors. Um, Vape Wilds is like that. So you want to mark that box because it will mess up with your PG VG ratio. And then you will add... Um, your PG um, VG ratio as to what I'm sorry as to what it is if it is not zero you will add it there then over here you will add how many percent you want in your flavor normal going ratio percent wise for your flavoring is about 15 to 20 percent I do 20 if you want a stronger flavor you do more if you want less flavor you do less 
Also, if you're doing multiple flavors, like you want the nut to be a hint, you put like 5%. If you want the caramel to be a little more, you put like 10, 15%, and so, 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 so. And then, down here at the bottom, where it says target PG, VG, this is where your total VG, PG ratio is going to be. It can be 50, 50, it can be 65 VG, it can be um, 70 PG, 30 VG. This is what I usually do. I usually do 70 PG, and you see how it changes the VG for you automatically? That's nice. I'm a big PG girl, so if you want more VG, add more VG. If you want more PG, add more PG. And then there is a um, separate section down here for comments or notes if you want to add to it. You also have the option after you get ready to close this out, you can save this entire formulary as a, a text so that you can come back to this in another time and it's already saved for you. You don't have to calculate anything out. You can have it later, save for a later date. Okay? Now, after you've done all this calculating, you're going to go down here to the bottom and hit this calculate button. Okay? calculate. Now, up here, it's done all the calculating for you. Let's see if I can. It's done all the calculating for you. It's done all the ingredients, including your flavors. It's done how many milliliters you're going to need of each ingredient how many drops you're going to need of each ingredient, how many percentage of total that you've got for each item. And it shows that all on your screen for you. That's right. And um, it shows it all in there in milliliters, drops, and percentage of total of all your ingredients. Your nicotine, your PG, your VG, your water vodka, and your flavoring all listed and your totals it tells you the totals as well down at the bottom that way you can calculate everything out in your bottle for you now if you want to make a bigger total uh, a bigger amount you just go over here and you change your totals you change everything to match what you need and that's that and that's how you use the e-juice calculator if anybody has any questions please leave a comment below i will leave a link in the description below of how to acquire the uh e-juice me up calculator and that's it y'all have a great day catch you on the flip side